Rhino Trailers wanted to show you guys another off-road trailer we just got in stock. This one's a 2019 7x18 off-road trailer. This one is in a matte bronze without the blackout package, so it gives you guys some different options there. And it is a matte bronze exterior, so you guys can see that in the color. You've got a nice extended triple tube tongue here with a generator platform, extra tall diamond plate rock guard on the front, and some nice big wrapped corners as well. Side door does have an overhead gutter. You've got a nice LED spot there and a window in that side door. Double R protection as well with an RV lock and cam bar. This one is equipped with a power package so you do have a exterior GFI outlet right there next to that side door as well. Two 3,500 pound axles, torsion axles, mud train, 32 inch mud train tires, black American racing wheels, and of course brakes on all fours. And then you've got that nice diamond plate fender to go with that. There's your windows right there as well as an aluminum roof rack with ladder. You guys can access off the side. This one does have drop down stabilizer jacks and it has bogey wheels or roller wheels. So double bonus there. You guys don't ever have to worry about dragging the back of this trailer if you ever would because you've got the extra ground clearance with the off-road package as well. Triple strip LED tail lights. You also have a nice spotlight over your ramp door so you guys are going to have great load light with this unit. Here is gives you guys a better shot here and then we're going to cheat and go on the side door because like I said I just got this in they just got unloaded and I don't have enough space to drop this ramp. Seven foot interior height. So it's going to be great for razors, UTVs, side by sides, that sort of thing with your extra interior height. You guys can see how easy it is to get in and out. Back side of this RV lock gives you guys this piece, which is a lock, a latch, a set of keys. There's a better shot of that window right there. And then this one is fully insulated. We've got insulated walls and ceiling in this unit. A couple of the 18 by 44 slider windows with screens. These are tinted. They're lockable. Really great options there. And again, Nice big interior height in here for having bigger toys. Nudo floor with dry max, that's what this is. This is one of the best performing floors we can stick in a trailer. It's got this great durable surface on top, and then it also has a dry max product below, which is a product that does not absorb the water or moisture. And that's what's on the underneath side of the trailer as well. So you guys are gonna have to worry about wood floors rotting out and that sort of a thing. Now you also have four LED puck lights on each side of the trailer here. So awesome interior light. You guys are going to have tons of light with these little puck lights. And I love these because you can control them individually as well. So you have the toggle switches on them. So if you guys want to have your reading light on or you need to be able to see what you're doing to make beds up or just deal with toys or whatever, you've got those options in here. Light switches right here. One is going to turn on that spot over the side door. The other one is going to turn on the interior pucks. Now you also have, again, a power package. So you've got a couple of different interior outlets. It looks like two on this side. And then another two here up at the front. Now these are gonna run right here with your 30 amp box. You take this cord, pop it right through the floor, go into your generator, and that's gonna power up the trailer, powers up all of your interior outlets. It's gonna also turn on your AC unit with a heat strip. And then you also have a battery in here, which is a bonus with a charger. Now that little battery is gonna run all of your interior and exterior lights. So you guys don't have to have the generator on at night, especially if you're somewhere where you don't wanna run a generator at midnight to have any light inside or outside of the trailer. So flip those on and you guys can see they do come on because of the battery power. So another nice option and again, those are gonna run both those spots as well. Overhead max air roof vent on top, but has a bubble cover over it so it won't leak water in. And then back here, this light switch is for when you guys have your ramp door down, you can drop that ramp and bam, immediately get some load light with that LED spot off the back. So I'm gonna spin around here, talk about E-Track. We've got lots of E-Track in here. This one's down a little bit lower. So you've got E-Track, it looks like, I don't know, about a foot or so off the floor, all the way on the walls. Plus we need E-Track on the floor. So awesome tie down points in here. For different toys, if you guys haul different stuff all the time, this is a great setup because it gives you a lot of different options on how you're gonna tie stuff down. So here it is. It looks like we have about a 4,500 payload capacity with this unit. And as always, we'd love to earn you guys' business. If you don't live near us, that's okay. We've got an amazing transporter that runs for great rates. So you guys can call and get a shipping quote from us. We'd be happy to ship you a trailer. And as always, you can reach us at 303-688-8485 or check us out online anytime at coloradotrailersinc.com.